गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ क्लास नाइन इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस द चैप्टर द बॉन्ड ऑफ लव द राइटर ऑफ दिस स्टोरी इज कैनि एंडरसेन कैन देयर बी लव एंड फ्रेंडशिप बिटवीन ह्यूमन बींग्स एंड वाइल्ड एनिमल्स येस यू हैव रेड मैनी स्टोरीज एंड नाउ इन दिस स्टोरी वी विल ऑल्सो रीड अबाउट A sloth bear that was rescued, rescued, saved by the author, and after that there is a friendship between them. Sloth bears inhabit forested areas, including the tropical rainforest of India and grasslands. At lower elevations, sloth bears have very shaggy hair, as you can see in the picture, and long muzzles. Using their claws to dig, they can use their lips to form a tube which can go deep into the ground or into heart to reach areas like that trees for their food their main food is termites now i am telling you what is the meaning of the title the bond of love the bond of love describes the lo love and friendship between a baby and a sloth between a lady a lady and a sloth bear the humans unleash unconditional unconditional love upon him but the bear fails to become a family member still the bond of love brings them together after separation the story puts emphasis on the power of love so the title is very appropriate and now In this story the writer tells us about the bond of love that existed between his wife and Bruno Bruno is the name of the bear when the bear was brought it was a child when grew Bruno grew as a big giant bear it was sent to a zoo and the separation of Arthur's wife with the bear became unbearable thus in this story Kenneth Anderson and the son shows that there can be bond of love and friendship between man and animal the author got a baby bear by accident it was presented to his wife who named it bruno and looked after it like her own child gradually bruno started eating everything bruno was like a naughty child one day bruno ate some of the poison and was recovered by an immediate treatment being grown in size it needed open and more space to live he was very fond of Arthur's wife she changed her name from Bruno to Baba on advice of Arthur's friend he was sent to the Mysore zoo this separation became inconsolable for Arthur's wife she sent many letters to the zoo authorities and inquired about baba on getting knowledge that baba was eating nothing she visited baba at mysore zoo bruno recognized her and howled with happiness she did not want to be separated with him and requested his superintendent to send baba back he consented and baba was brought back at home some special arrangement were made for his stay a 20 feet long and 15 feet wide island was made for him a wooden box was kept for his comfortable sleep he was delighted the author's wife used to spend hours sitting with him in this way they after that became happy so students i think you are able to understand the story the bond of love what is the bond the bond between the bond between the bear and bruno so thank you students